Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna make this super simple today. All you have to do is remember the three A's of business acumen. And even acumen starts with an A. All right, this is very simple to remember and very simple to implement. One is agility, all right? When I was younger, I had more physical agility. I have less physical agility now, but I have more business agility. That means I'm willing to be more flexible. I'm willing to make quick changes when I see something in the marketplace that I don't like. Ben and I were just talking about changes in the market. Well, as small business owners, we can all be agile. That's an advantage we have over large businesses that have a much harder time turning the ship around, right? We have a small boat, we can adapt quickly, which leads me to the second A, is adaptability. Agility, quick flexibility, quick thinking. Adaptability doesn't mean being complacent, it means adapting to market circumstances. If people, for example, now don't like to pay with credit card and they wanna pay with Cash App or with Venmo or with Zelle, why don't you become more adaptable to receive those forms of payment? You're adapting to what the marketplace wants. You can't say, well, we've always just accepted checks and that's all we're gonna accept. Be adaptable, okay? Now, the third thing that I like and that I struggle with some of the time is I want to be proactive. I know it starts with an P, but you wanna be active. You don't wanna be reactive and wait to see what happens. That's what a lot of people did in 2020. The pandemic hit and most people, most business owners, you ask, what are you doing differently in your business? They said, well, we're just waiting to see what happens. Now, a year later, some of them are waiting to see if things got back to the way they were before. They weren't active. So if you already see changes coming, you're adaptable and you have agility, why don't you be active? Go out and seek those clients. Go out and seek that new product or service that you didn't even know you were going to offer. You do all this stuff, you're proactive, you're gonna be that much better than, again, the big competitors, even in your small competitors. I see so many people in marketing that rely on word of mouth. And that's fantastic. If you have it, that's great. But you know what? Sometimes that dries up as well. Then things slow down. But if you're always active, you're always moving, you'll have that third formula, that recipe for business acumen. And if you have that, you'll be a lot better off than your competitors.